everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is just a little sneak of what we have for the April haul. I thought I would just do this sort of intro outro situation just because I've seen Rachel have gathered plans to it and I enjoy her videos and I thought might as well just throw some of that into mine. Um, but really quickly I did want to mention if you see some of this unicorn washi um, it's because I outlined what you guys can see in the frame just so I can kind of try to stay in frame all of that fun stuff. As always, I will have the little icons in the corner saying whether it was a PR order, if it was an order from a shop that I have a coupon code for, or if it's something that I spent my own money on, um, just because I do want to keep things as open and honest as possible. And I will have every shop that I used, including any coupon codes that I know of, regardless of if they're mine or not, in the comments down below. Um, sorry, this is kind of quick better use dying, just finished actually filming the haul, that I would do the intro outro in this situation. Um, but yeah, so go ahead and keep on watching if you're interested in seeing what I got from different shops. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So this is the start of my April haul. I am filming this on April 4th. Not that anybody needed to know that. Um, I'm hoping that this will be like one of two segments in the haul. I'm trying to be a little bit more like self-control, saving everything to the very end. Um, but I did want to use this specific kit and a couple of overlays that I have over the, like to the side um, in this month. So I thought I would just get these guys out of the way and again just save my two other packages for the um, remainder of the haul. So the first shop that I have to show you guys is Perfect Prince Co. I did go ahead and just take everything out of the mailer but I thought I would show it because it is just this super cute like buffalo check mailer and if you guys have any ideas of how to like repurpose these please let me know in the comments down below just because I do feel super wasteful because this is a bubble wrap plastic ass mailer. Um, other thing, I should have probably put this in the intro part, but there might be a little bit of a sprinkling of sailor language somewhere in between this. Um, I'm gonna try to not, just because, I don't know. I don't know why I would try to not, but if it comes out, it comes out and I'm not gonna edit it out or anything like that. Um, but anyways, yes, I thought this was super cute. Um, kind of sad that it's plastic, but also that's just the planner world. That's besides the point. Um, but I got these super duper gorgeous, gorgeous. Ah, if I can get them out. Tweezers that say geeky planning on them and I'm so excited to use these. Um, I picked these up during the March TPC sale I want to say um, and I would 10 out of 10 recommend checking her out specifically during the TPC sale because I believe she's a moderator um, for it and she always has like an amazing discount um, but also just check her out in general and they're like the super cute like needle nose type um tweezers and I'm so excited to use these. I have just been using like some rinky dink chibi db um like eyebrow tweezers that I had duplicates of so I don't use these for my eyebrows these are only for stickers um but now I have dedicated tweezers for stickers and I'm so excited because they say geeky planning in this beautiful like blue shift hollow um so yeah I would 10 out of 10 recommend checking out her shop for personalized tweezers and then the second thing that I got was I believe during the TPC sale she always has a limited edition kit um, and I'm so excited for this one. Uh, okay um, let me just open this. I feel like I'm just such a nerd about being excited for it that I can't even open it. Um, Okay, so I know that her shop, Perfect Prince Co., does have a subscription, but these are, like, if you can see, like, March limited edition, and I want to say the limited edition items are only during the TPC sale. Um, so these were the freebies. The theme for the sale was 90, so you got this super cute, like, Tamagotchi, and then you have, like, the Tamagotchi, the GameCube, the VHS. I don't know what these two are. They're some sort of console controller type thing. Um... But yeah, I just think these are all so cute. I won't have any like functional use for these, but I do want to try to figure out a way of how to use them. Um, but that's besides the point. So again, this is Perfect Prince Co. And these are the like foiled headers. Hopefully you guys can see the foil somewhere. These are in silver foil, I believe. Yeah, it's silver foil. Um, so here are the headers. 
And then here is the first functional sheet. So it does just come with like your checklists, um, some scripts. So it has date night, lazy day, payday, binge watch Netflix, laundry, happy mail, don't forget, cleaning day, change the sheets, and then plan. And it has like some super tiny cute builders. There's also workout. Sorry, I think I didn't mention that one. Um, habit trackers, flags, quarter boxes, scalp boxes, which I love her scalp boxes, um, like little appointment labels, laptop, like just random icons. And I love the way that she uses up the sheet like it's not just like so all of the scripts are here and there's literally no room for anything else like no like she tries to sprinkle in everything to try to maximize the sheet space and I love that so much I'm um, so again this is the functional sheet and then we have the second functional sheet so it just has like the super cute super thick weekend banner um, a fancy label three heart checklists nine quarter boxes and then nine half boxes and then we have the headers, littles, um, and then like random washi. So we have today to do littles, the actual little things, the random headers, more little things. And then these are all just cut strips of washi and they are continuous. Like, so it's not like there's that gap. So if you did want to stack them all up, it would just give you the little pattern there. And then we have the ombre heart checklists. <laughs> Don't peep at that one, <laughs> the ombre heart checklists. And then like the sideboard tracker, uh, okay, so my camera cut me off because the SD card was full. Um, we're not going to talk about that. Um, let me just try to zoom you guys in a little bit more. Okay, so hopefully that does something. Um, but again, it has... I don't know where it cut me off. Let me just flip through the other pages of the kit. So there was Umber Heart Checklists, Little Things, Functional, Other Functional Page, and then Foiled Glitter Headers, Freebie, and Tamagotchi. Um, again, I don't know where it cut me off, but it cut me off somewhere. Um, so we're just gonna ignore that part. But these are just super gorgeous. So it has um, Ursula's Eel, Scully, Ariel, Sebastian and Flounder, um, the Pipe, a Dingle Hopper, a Starfish, King Triton, Ariel as a Mermaid, Prince Eric, and Ursula. <laughs> Ursula looks so beautiful. I love her. So she's my favorite villain. That's literally the only reason I loved this kit was because Ursula came out so good and I've seen some other kits where they try to like modernize Ursula and it's not my favorite thing ever um so yeah so just unpopular opinion no one needs to know this um but I personally think The Little Mermaid the actual movie is kind of I don't want to say trash but her as a person like she gives up literally everything to be with a person like I don't know I this is way too deep into this but you shouldn't change who you are to like find love or anything like love will find you if you are you you know what I mean um no one needed to know that so I personally don't like The Little Mermaid the movie but I love Ursula because she is just like the best villain out there in my personal opinion so let's just take a moment to admire Ursula um and then the super gorgeous bottom washi so it has like this like ginormous shell pattern um more like continuous washi strips date numbers and then the date covers as well so there's that that was this kit and again i love this so much so good um and check her out i would recommend during the tpc sale but you can check her out whenever because there are no rules to planning um but again, this is all I got from Perfect Prints Co. during the March TPC sale. The first shop that I have to share with you guys is Nicole Alexia Designs. And I just think it's really cute that on the back of like her mailers or whatever, um, she has like the little seal that says Nikki, Mom, and Ozzy. Just because I feel like that's the dream team, Nikki, her mom, and then her little dog, Ozzy. I just think that's super cute and a nice little touch to add and then one thing that I also like super appreciated and thought was super personable was on her invoices she writes thank you so this is two different orders and both of them said thank you on the invoices in like her hand written you know Nis she wrote it herself I don't know why I said handwritten obviously it's handwritten if she wrote it herself um but these are the things that I ordered again these were two separate orders one of them was from the UPS I always want to see UPS sale but the ultimate planner sale the up sale um and then the other one was just a random new release weekend okay so we'll go ahead and go through the kits 
first, the first kit that I picked up was her sunflower kit in gold foil and this is just super stunning and I think it's very I don't know if obvious is the right word but Nikki definitely puts her personal style into the clip art um just because I feel like even if she uses generic clip art or I don't want to say generic clip art but clip art that a lot of shops use or clip art like that's exclusive to her or that no one else has really used you can definitely tell that she puts it in her own style and I just think it always comes out super stunning. So these are the full boxes. Again, this was in gold foil. And then this is the box like sampler page. So it comes with the boxes with the little sprinklings of bows, the bow checklists, and these super cute little like half scallops. This is the first run of her all foil kit. So it has like two different bow headers to do today headers, a bunch of washi strips, and then some labels. And then it also just comes with the bottom washi, some like flags and arrows, have a tracker, sidebar stuff, and then the date covers. And again, all of this was in her gold foil and it just looks super stunning. And then the next kit that I picked up from Nikki's shop was her moon kit. And this again was in her gold foil, but it looks a little bit more of like a champagne-y type than the first one, but both of them are for sure gold. Like it's just, I guess, slight variances in her gold. Um, but these are the full boxes. And then the half boxes, bow checklists and scallops. And then this was the second format. So you can see this one has two different like all bows and then two different line bows and then all of the washi strips and the boxes and then this is the bottom washi and date covers which again is super stunning so that was the second kit and one thing I will say is I hope that in the future um Nikki makes it so there's three different types of bows I personally think it would be super gorgeous if she did like the bow confetti as one of these so it's like you have the line bows the like bows all the way across and then the confetti bows so it's three different types of bows but it's still all within the same thing hopefully that makes sense I highly doubt that it did but that was the second kit that I picked up and then I am going to just pull my planner over for reference I've seen um Rochelle of planned princess and then Rachel of gathered plans do this um pretty recently but this is the like non-kit stuff that I got from her shop so this was the first freebie and the second freebie again these were two different um orders so these are the two different freebies and then I also should have had this in the beginning um but I also did just use Jana of Jana Katharina plans or Jana K plans on Instagram I'll have her linked down below um, if you use Jana 15, you do get 15% off of Nikki's shop, not including the sales for the foil kits on the weekends. Um, I could be wrong, but check out Nikki or Jana for, you know, the correct information. Um, but this was her freebie and then I did just get a couple of the flat lays. So there was the baking one and then, um, the like planning one. So you can see they're pretty much like the width of a box. Like they're essentially a half box. So there's a planning one and then also a baking one. And then I'm just going to show you guys like these four, but I picked them up in all four foils. So there are the work scripts, the um, YouTube icons in the pink and the gray, and then the icon sampler page. So it's just for size reference. And these are all four of those in rose gold. Hopefully you can see that. gold I'm very bad at this wiggly situation um, silver uh, and hollow and I don't know what it is about Nikki's hollow, but I feel like her hollow is just extra rainbowy and beautiful and sparkly. So 10 out of 10 recommend if you're going to pick up anything from her shop, pick up something in hollow. And that is everything I got from Nicole Alexia Designs.
Again, I'll have her and her PR codes. Usually I use either Jana15, who is Jana K Plants on Instagram, or April15, who is Georgia Girl Plants on Instagram um, for Nikki's shop. I will have um, Nikki and both PR girls linked in the description down below. And then next I have a PR order from RG Paper Designs. Um, from Rachel's shop, I did just pick up two kits and then a bunch of random stuff. So we'll go through the first kit. And I do like that she has um, like the name of the kit and then either for the Erin Condren or the Happy Planner on the side of the cello. And then anytime you pick up a full kit, it does automatically come with the glitter headers. Um, so you can use Stephanie 25 for 25% off of Rachel's shop um, or really any of the PR girls. I recommend myself just because, you know, I'm selfish and I'm going to recommend me. But you can check out any of the PR girls to see whose freebie you like the best. Um, but this is the Just Peachy kit. So these are the full boxes, the headers and little things, the date covers, date dots, and then a bunch of deco. And I really really love how big her deco is just because you can use it as an icon or you can use it as deco and I just think it turns out super gorgeous within a spread. I'm wiggling around like if it's foiled. These are not foiled. Um, and then these are on her premium matte paper. I prefer her premium matte just because it's super vibrant and you can use any pen that you want but she also does offer glossy. And then the ombre heart checklists, the like half boxes sheet, the bottom washi, which these are two individual like 15 millimeter strips. So if you wanted to pull in a simply gilded washi, you definitely have that option. And then these were the glitter headers. And again, that was the Just Peachy kit. And then I also picked up the Summer Collection. Um, so these are again the full boxes in the beautiful beautiful premium matte paper i actually don't know if it's premium matte it's definitely not a unicorn matte but it's a matte paper that's as vibrant as glossy if not even more vibrant um but again these are the full boxes the litters litters littles and headers I tried combining those and it doesn't work um the half boxes and like box sampler page the date covers, date dots, and deco, which again, this is super cute. If anybody can find that outfit, please let me know. I want to be like Lucas of Planner Boy Jams and just recreate all of the fashion girls um, in real life because I just think that is super cute and super fun. So if anybody finds that outfit, please let me know. And then the like sampler page with the weekend banner, heart checklist, sidebar stuff, and the work labels, the ombre heart checklists, the washi, which again, these are two individual strips, and then the glitter headers. Finally, from Rachel's shop, I have just a bunch of other random things that I picked up in my order. So this is her business card, and she does have little rewards. So whenever you get her like general shop freebie, it does come with a little icon that you can just like take, and you stick it on the card to redeem your free sticker sheet. And then this is her freebie. These are the new icons that she just came out with. So there's a little pizza, fork and knife, cake, gas pump, um, coffee cups, and then just like random boxes that you can use. And this is just super gorgeous, super stunning. Definitely picking up the coffee cup and the pizza on their own individual sheets. And I also picked up the beach day script. I got the wash hair customs just because I got very tired of writing it in my own planner and I love her custom scripts it comes with an insane amount like look at how much are in here there's one two three four five six one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen I don't know what six times thirteen is what is that like ninety not ninety seventy two like seventy eight let's we're just gonna check my math yeah, 78. Um, so there's 78 scripts in here. So this is literally enough for me for about a year and a half of just wash hair scripts because I only wash my hair once a week. Um, but I just think that's an insane value for her custom scripts because they are the same as her regular scripts. I also got the work scripts and then her event labels in the blush, fall, summer, and neutral colorways um just because i like these because they're shorter than like the spc square boxes but they do the same effect and these are just super 
super gorgeous how much can I say super cute super gorgeous all that fun stuff but again this is everything I picked up from RG Paper Designs Rachel's shop you can use Stephanie 25 for 25 percent off of your order plus my freebie or you know any of the other PR girls that I recommend me but also check out the rest of them because they are all amazing and kind human beings so that's all for Rachel's shop And next we have, ugh, I think I just left my address. And next we have Rose Colored Days. Um, can we just talk about Lauren and how fast she's with her shop? So I ordered these on Friday. I believe it was March 20th. Um, yeah, I want to say it was Friday, March 20th when she did the new release for her like um, date cover tapes and the underlays for them and then she also restocked her bougie box overlays um so i ordered these on friday the 20th i got the shipping notification the following tuesday and they were in my mailbox the next friday like how insane is that i love how quick lauren is with her shop i feel like i've never waited more than a week whether it be for a subscription or from an actual order from her shop so she is just killing it in more levels than like i can even comprehend um okay so let me just open up all of these guys and then we'll talk about them Okay, so that was me unboxing, or not unboxing, like, um, opening, basically. I was opening all the tapes. Um, so these are the freebies that came with the order. So this is, like, the super gorgeous, um, like, navy blue, shifty, not shifty, um, but it's just, like, super cute navy blue, almost, like, indigo-y type, um, overlays so you have like the double stroke overlays and then the thick stroke with Lauren's bow and I think this is so cute and I so appreciate her freebies being like this um just because the, this is like actually functional unlike I don't know unfunctional freebies but besides the point so there was that and then this is Lauren's business card and I don't know about anybody else um but anytime I say just breathe I always think of that like musical episode of Grey's Anatomy where Lexi Meredith's sister okay spoiler alert if you haven't seen Grey's Anatomy a what are you doing b I shouldn't have to say spoiler alert because it's been out forever um but spoiler alert if you um see the episode Lexi sings just breathe and a her voice is beautiful but also I can never just say it I always have to like sing it in my head I'm not going to because no one wants their ears to bleed um but yeah, I think that's just kind of funny. That's also probably just me. And then um, it also came with this super cute um, like April monthly dashboard type thing. And I did see Lauren on her Instagram say that like for if you're not going to use any of these, you can just lay them on here, probably on the back side where the foiling, actually not on the back side because right here it feels kind of embossed. I don't know on one of the sides you can just lay down um her tapes because they are removable um so there should be no issue on that front um so those were all of the freebies that i got from this and then i'm just gonna move these this was me picking apart the overlays um from creativity and ink to make a double box overlay actually let me just show you guys this really quickly because i'm like high key really proud of what i did um so unrelated, not part of Lauren's shop, but Creativity and Ink. Um, I like, she has these like star full box overlays. So I basically just cut the bottom of two of them and stacked them. So now I have like a tall box overlay and this was the part that I cut off. So this would have been like the bottom of that box and this would have been the top of that box, but I just cut it off and now it's this super cute tall box overlay. You can do this with literally anybody's overlays, but I just thought I would throw that guy in there. Um, Anyways, besides the point, so I'm gonna use this to go ahead and just start laying some of these guys down and I will be right back. 
Okay, so I did go ahead and just like take all of the tapes, open them, um, and then rip them out onto here. So let's go ahead and start with the bougie boxes. So those are these four tapes. Um, and so this one is the gold. Hopefully you can see that. Like you'll probably be able to see the color better on the roll. Um, so that was gold. This one is the silver. Try to like shift that a little bit. The rose gold is up here. And the hollow is down here. And then I also did go ahead and um, do both of the like date cover overlays. Um, so as you can see, they don't really start with the same day. Um, so these are, I believe, her playful font. And so we have the gold, silver, rose gold, and hollow, and the same respectively, gold, silver, rose gold, and hollow um, in the rolls. And then same thing for the, I believe this was her calligraphy font. So gold, silver, rose gold, hollow, gold, silver, rose gold, hollow. And again, they don't necessarily start on the same day, but I don't really care because either way you're going to use seven of them. So let's say like, for example, the tape started on a Wednesday, you would still use Wednesday through, through, through Tuesday. And then if you want to use the silver again, it would still be Wednesday through Tuesday. Like as long as you're not doing a mixed metal moment, which, oh my gosh, I literally just realized this would be so good for a mixed metal moment. Um, but again, as long as you're not doing that, you should be like easy peasy, A-OK -okay with all of these. Um, but also let's just move on to some unnecessary planner math. Um, so each of Lauren's rolls come with 10 meters, right? So that goes to 10,000, let me just center myself a little bit, millimeters, right? Right? Okay. Stay with me. Stay with me. Um, okay. So if each of these like all four i guess all 16 12 all 12 of the tapes were perforated at the 1.5 inch mark 1.5 inches is 38.1 millimeters right right okay okay so and let's just start off with the date covers so for those you would need seven in each week um hold on also let me just check that i'm even in frame because that would be embarrassing okay yeah in frame kind of okay let's make this a little bit lower don't do that um so if you had like the 38.1 meters times seven days in a week is 266.7 millimeters Per each week right so if you do the 10,000 divided by 266.7 equals 37 let's just say 37 just to round it off you have 37 weeks worth of headers or I'm sorry of date covers per one individual roll roll and then times four because there's four different colors is 149 and then you divide that by 52 weeks a year 2.88 ish again this is all ish weeks or sorry you have essentially three years worth of headers per one like set but you have 37 weeks per each individual roll like that's actually kind of insane um again that's not including any like mixed metal moments that's not including like really anything else it's just like each individual roll and then each set so if you were to get both of the sets you would get what is that like five point like one, 5.2, I was so off. So if you were to get both sets, you would essentially have like five point, you would have five years and then up until like September of date covers in just this. Like I don't need to buy date covers for five years. That's actually kind of insane. Um, so <laughs> there's that for you. And then for the, confetti full boxes so again if each of the like individual days is 38.1 okay so really quickly i don't know where this left off um but so now onto the confetti full box overlay so if each individual like day so one of these guys is 38.1 millimeters right and you need about 14 or you don't need about you would need exactly 14 if you were to use all seven 
full boxes, right? So if you do times 14, that gives you 80.759 millimeters. I feel like I did this wrong. I did that wrong. I'm not even multiplying the right numbers. So that's not right. 38.1 times 14. 500 and 33.4 millimeters per spread, right? Right, stay with me, stay with me. So, <laughs> what am I even doing? So if you were to do the 533.4 millimeters and divide that by the 10,000 millimeters per each roll, or you would divide it the other way around. Switch these guys. So we would do 10,000 divided by that guy is 18.74 spreads, right? So you have 18 spreads per one roll. And then if you were to multiply that by the four rolls, because this comes with an entire whole last set, so you times four rolls, 74, let's just, this is 74.9. We're just going to say 74. So 74 in total spreads. Like that's 74 weeks. Not including any like day extenders. Not including anything like that. But just like straight up out of the 21 boxes you have in each spread. 14 of those are going to have some sort of bougie. Um, so you have a little bit over a year. Like and just to think of how long it like how many sheets of individual like bougie boxes just because they do come with four bougie boxes in each like sheet I'm trying to word this so you have 74 spreads right and each spread by or let's let's just talk about one roll we're just gonna do one roll so 18.74 let's just lower that down to 18 spreads right I'm going all over the place don't don't mind me so you have 18 spreads. So if each like box or sheet of bougie boxes come with four bougie boxes and you need 14 per spread, you would need three and a half bougie box sheets per spread, right? So if you were to do the 18 spreads times three and a half sheets, you would need 63 sheets of bougie boxes per each spread. So just for like comparison's sake, I don't know how many sheets this comes with. So this has about 30 sheets of like stickers, right? This is just a Mombi, Me and Big Ideas, Happy Planner sticker book sheet, right? So you would need essentially this much thickness. This one's a lot thicker. Hold on, we're not gonna do that one. This thick worth of bougie boxes to make up for one of these guys and I rounded down so it might actually be a lot more so just imagine just imagine how many trees you're saving how much money you're saving like this roll by itself let's just say Lauren prices them at ten dollars right and if you do 63 sheets to make up one roll even if those sheets were a dollar and this was ten dollars you would be saving fifty dollars like that's insane props to Lauren for a making her rolls 10 meters instead of five meters which like not to throw any shade, but a lot of shops do make their tapes 5 meters and Lauren makes them 10. And I'm just like, that's actually insane. Um, but yeah, let me just get off my high horse. Let me just get off my high horse. Who will stop this planner math. But just to reiterate, with one roll, you would get about 18 spreads worth of um, bougie boxes. And then with one roll of date covers, you would get about... 37 spreads worth of date cover. So just keep that in mind. Go support Lauren. She's doing so many innovative things. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna stop with that. So let's get on to the, I'm gonna say the rest of the Rose Color Days order because I believe I, I'm still gonna do the subscription. So the subscription should be after this if everything goes according to plan. So let's get on to the subscription and stop my talking. And next we have the um, Rose Color Days Overlay subscription. Again, if you don't want to see this, swipe out. I don't believe this is a mystery. She does sneak all of this on her Instagram and her Facebook. But if you don't want to see it, swipe out now while well, you can. Um, just take some of these guys out of here. 
So again, this is Lauren's Overlay Subscription and the like specialty foil was this gorgeous gold hollow situation and then like the normal foil is just gold. So my camera cut me off and I'm not really 100% sure where. Um, but again, for the Rose Color Days Overlay Subscription, there was the double stroke, the single stroke, and then the like thicker double stroke in the gold hollow. And then in the animal print, there is the like leopard, cheetah-ish, and then zebra, tiger-ish prints in just the standard gold. And then there's also a quote that says wild thing. I should center this. Um, but these are the overlays that came as the full box overlays. And then as the like extra overlays, the two header ones are the cheetah leopard print in gold hollow and gold. Hopefully you can see the hollowness of the gold hollow. And then the washi strips, both the 15 millimeter and the 30 millimeter were in that cheetah print. So there's just the 15 millimeter plain one and then the 30 millimeter that's like confetti cheetah print, if that makes any sense. Um, and then the other things that it came with were just like the May journaling card and then the wild thing journaling card and then also these are the full box overlays that are in the gold hollow super gorgeous like the little giraffe pebbly situation and then um, the cheetah print ones Okay. And that is everything from the Rose Colored Days Overlay. Super cute. And again, I will say this from now until whenever I stop getting these, I 1000% appreciate the fact that Lauren does the specialty foil as a very generic overlay. And then the like non specialty foil, like the generic foil in a specific format situation, like these are very specific to this overlay, but this one you can literally use, or to this subscription, but this one you can literally use with anything and everything. Um, and I 10 out of 10, 1000% appreciate that in this. Um, so that is everything I got from Lauren of Rose Colored Days in the overlay subscriptions. Last but certainly not least, I have two separate orders from Scribble Prince Co. A mystery kit and then just like a random order. So let's go through the random one first and she's kind of chunky um there's quite a bit in this little bitty stack um don't know where to throw her so the first thing that i picked up or i shouldn't really say the first thing um but one of the things that i got was this journaling card there's an ant shoe, shoe ant um, but this journaling card is loved you then, love you still, always have, always will. And I just think this is super cute and very SPC. I think I've seen many, many like foiled quote overlays, journaling cards, just quotes and kits that are this one specifically. And I love it. I just, anytime I hear this, I specifically think Andrea of SPC. Um, and then on the other side is Will You Be My Valentine, which I think this is super cute. And then I did use Kirsten of Kirsten Plans, her discount code so kirsten 10 and her freebie came in rose gold and then this was just the all order freebie and i just think the little andrea and i believe this is supposed to be bennett but now it can also be theo her other baby um but andrea and her baby are just so cute and i'd rather die <laughs> that is so cute and this was the all order freebie from scribble prints co and then i also did just pick up the work scripts in all four foils so there's rose gold silver gold and hollow gorgeous and then next from spc i also got the 15 millimeter i almost said bow the 15 millimeter washi like grab bag situation so it came with this hot pink this light pink this like blue color this peachy color this like tealish green color a more foresty green brown and orange a like more violently purple purple 
um, and then this like scarlet color and I think these are great like I personally recommend if you are going to order from SPC just throw one of these into your cart it's like two bucks um, for 10 different like 15 millimeter strips and I think these are just great to have in your collection just because if you don't use an SPC kit if you forgot to pick up a 15 millimeter or if you just don't like the 15 millimeter that you picked up for the kit you just have a bunch of other ones and you can also extend your kits this way so 10 out of 10 recommend if you're going to shop from SBC just throw one of these into your cart and call it a day um, and then this guy was one of the large foiled grab bags so it came with this like hollow I almost said silver but it's a hollow like bow and script sampler and then the like family scripts in the J Crew letters in silver, the Munchkin freebie in rose gold, the J Crew like school scripts in silver, the New Year scripts in silver, the icons in gold. And again, this was a grab bag, so all of these are like. I expected them to be a lot worse but in reality like the only one that's wrong with this one is the Instagram and I to be like completely honest probably won't use it um so I just think these are a great thing to just add into your cart and these are the same icons in like this pretty blue color the wedding ones in gold this one will be very hard to see um but this is like a white foil almost I think this was her ivory wiggle um, and then corners in hollow, this gold on peach flags and bows, the like CD type gold hollow um, with the numbers and the icons, this peachy in icons and date dots, and then this like orangey one which this one was the ones that had like the little top, but I believe Andre said that you can just take like your tweezers and pick at it and it'll come like right off. Um, but I honestly don't mind you can do that or cut it off. It's on a clear sticker paper, doesn't matter. Um, so there's that guy. The oil slick in the twinkle format for the full box overlays. The simplified bows in like a hollow champagne gold. The like orange I think this was like orange soda, soda pop, something like that. The chunky glitter header overlays, the peachy twinkle overlays, the hollow on white glossy paper, the hollow like a space sampler situation, um, the chunky in silver. Again, the white ones, you won't be able to see this, but they look really pretty in person. The gold on white glossy paper, silver on white glossy paper, hollow on white glossy paper, and then a couple of 15 millimeter strips. There's a rose gold one and a silver one and both in that simplified bow. And then the silver on white glossy um, 15 millimeter strips and then the white on glossy 15 millimeter strips. And then these, I believe, are for when she did TNs. These are like the dividers. I won't use these. I'm just going to throw them in like a de-stash bag or something for somebody else to have because I literally have zero use for this. Um, and then the bow seals in two different colorways. And then the baby um, rose gold ones. I legitimately have zero plans to have child, so I have zero use for this and zero use for this. But the other 28 sheets that came in this guy, I do use. So I think it was like $15 for all of this stuff. And I really only won't use two of these. So these two will go in like some de-stash bag. And these two I will be keeping. And then the last thing in this random order was her pride kit. This is the... This is the pride kit that she came out with last year because this year she has a pastel one and I am not the biggest fan of the pastel one. I am more of like a boom, boom, go, go, all the colors everywhere type situation. Um, and I don't know, I think this would be, I have a lot of exciting plans for this kit. Let's just leave it at that. I'm just gonna, in case I change my mind, I don't wanna put anything out into the universe. Um, but this came with the Andrea Munchkin freebie, the full boxes, which are super gorgeous. 
the ombre heart checklists, the like sampler page, the box sampler page, the large icon squared off boxes and then another full box, the little things washi strips and labels, the headers pattern washi and more fancy labels, deco work squared off boxes and weekend banner and then the bottom washi date covers and then i believe this was still yeah this is still the extra full box so not her newest format again just because this is the like 2019 pride kit and then this year she obviously has 2020 pride kit um but yeah that is everything that i got from spc that was not the mystery so disclaimer disclosure all that fun stuff if you don't want to see the SPC mystery, swipe out. Thank you for watching. Don't forget sparkle, all that fun stuff. Um, but if you do want to see spoilers, go ahead and keep on watching. And she is stunning. Again, if you can find her outfit, please let me know in the comments down below. We will all embrace Lucas of Planner Boy Jams and recreate all of the beautiful, beautiful fashion girls that the artists are coming out with and, you know, sticker shops are putting into their kits. I believe this was Kittenish Jess artwork. I could be wrong, um, but props to her or whoever did this because it came out super beautiful. Um, so these are the full boxes the like new page and I'm so excited to use this. I love these boxes. I love the extra like full boxes, the patterned squared off boxes. There's only two heart checklists like this is beautiful and gorgeous and everything in between. Um, there's deco, weekend banner, boxes, work labels, all that fun stuff. The like sidebar sampler page, the box sampler page, the patterned washi, patterned fancy labels, headers, and large icons. And I'm so glad that she didn't get rid of these just because the large icons are my favorite things from her kits. Like if she, any functional item that she has, my favorite is always the large icons. And then the, pa not pattern washi, solid washi, solid fancy labels, and little things. And then the washi date covers, and then the extra tie-dye full box. And I need to find some sort of beachy quote overlay to put on top of this guy because he is going in my spread. Um, I don't know why I assigned him gender and I assigned him he, but he is going in my spread. And then the extra set it came with was this super gorgeous like vinyl um, to put like on your water bottles. Like just put him on my Starbucks cup, make him super gorgeous. Uh, that was that. And then the tall boxes. And again, I need to recreate her at a beach somewhere in the sunset because she is gorgeous. And then the ombre 15 millimeter strip, the glitter headers, and then the solid, I almost said solid label add-on, but she only has one label add-on, but the label add-on. And then these are all other extras minus the journaling card. All of these are foil extras, which this is the journaling card. And I love that she changed it. So the mystery, both mini and ultimate come with this link foiled freebie that matches the foil that's going to be in the kit um so there's this guy and then these three were all extras as well just because it didn't come out the way Andrea planned like in my opinion the flags and the bows are perfect great to use the date cover is perfect great to use the icons however look like somebody spilled water on them I'm pretty sure it's just like the process that they used to foil and that's why it didn't come out like the way that they wanted them to. I'm still going to use these just because it still looks super gorgeous. It still matches the foil that the rest of this is in. Um, and I think that it's really nice that Andre threw it in anyways, even though they're not super usable for everybody. I can see why people wouldn't want to use them, but I would still take them. Yeah, yeah. The like script sampler page, the icons, and the bottom washi. So I'm not really sure where my camera cut me off. I don't mind staring at this kit again, so I'm just gonna go ahead and flip through everything super quickly. Again, this was the Andrea of SPC Mystery Kit, so it came with the full boxes, the like new page sampler thing, the deco page, the sidebar sampler page, the box sampler page, um, the new page with the washi headers and icons, the um, labels, Clean washi and little things, the bottom washi, the extras are this like vinyl sticker, 
this girl who is gorgeous need to recreate her again um 15 millimeter strip glitter headers solid labels journaling card and then these were the like misfit foil freebies which were the date covers flags and icons and then also the like new foil freebie which is super stunning and then the clear wiggle in stars so there's the stars like the little tiny decos the j crew letterings which are not letterings food i'm pretty sure this avocado has been here this whole time but this is the first time i noticed the avocado and it looks super cute even though i hate avocados um the icons and date dots three of the like star sampler bougie box things um the scripts icons and bottom washi so Again, that is everything from the SPC Mystery Kit. Okay, so that is it for this haul video. If you guys liked it, if you didn't like it, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, leave them in the comments section down below. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed hearing me ramble out of breath about, you know, different things that I got in that situation. And hopefully you guys didn't see the unicorns too much in this video. Um, but as I said previously, the shops and any coupon codes that I know of will be filmed or will be filmed <laughs> they will be in the comment section down below if you guys have any questions um feel free to ask them I probably won't respond super quickly because I'm you know trash but besides that that is pretty much everything thanks so much for watching and don't forget to sparkle bye guys